Good morning, good afternoon, and a very good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Tomb Raider. You are here with Morris, and at the end of the last part, we were just... Whoa. It sounded like Sam was in just a teeny tiny bit of trouble, so, uh, yeah. We, uh, we, should probably, we should probably press on really quickly. <laughs> we are just, we are just dawdling. We're taking in the sights, you know? We can't afford to do that. Alright, let's find a way around it. God, there are checkpoints all over this place. Does anybody remember the old Tomb Raider games? There was, like... Well, there, were no, there was no such thing as checkpoints. It was like, you friggin... That's not the way. If you didn't save it, you were buggered. The checkpoint was like the beginning of the level, and that was it. Are you sure I can't go this way? Seems fine. Oh, Christ. We're good. We're okay. I mean, we're okay, really. Everything is coming. What's the worst thing that could happen? Whoa, Christ. God, how does she... How does she survive this still? Oh my God, I remember this bit. Oh my God, well, this is not going to go well. <laughs> if anyone's played this, you'll probably know what I'm talking about. But it is very hard to see what's going on here. What? I didn't even see that. Come on. That is... Oh, jeez, that is brutal. That is brutal. If anybody wants to point out a way I could have ever avoided that without knowing where the hell I was going in advance, I would like to hear that. Ugh. I'm not a fan of these, these kind of segments, really. I mean, it's just there's so much going on here, you know? I don't mind scripted events, but when there's just this, like, can any, does anybody know what's going on? I sure as hell don't. Like, you have to preemptively go to the right there to avoid that, otherwise you screwed. I can't see it, can't see a thing. Can't see a thing. Oh, God. Oh, God. I just, this just reminds me of The Lost World. <laughs> God. Even the rucksack and everything. Oh, my God. Great, that was good. That was really good. That should slow my descent. Auxiliary parachute. I like it. Oh Christ. Oh, you just know I'm gonna die in this bit as well. <laughs> Ow! Jeez. Oh Christ. It's not good. It's not quite as smooth as a big boss's landing, is it? <laughs> I'm fine, I'm just a little scratched. I'm still good, it's still good. My hair still looks great. Which it does, let's be honest. Ooh. Look for first aid, eh? Do I have any on me? I feel like I should have some on me. Oh Christ, not good. Ow. That didn't help. That didn't help at all. Might be some supplies on board. Let's friggin' hope so. Oh, I got a skill point for getting my arse handed to me. That's good. What about the other one? No, no. We gotta keep looking. All right, let's check around the chopper. No, don't check around the chopper. I want to check around the chopper. The smell. Sound of disgust. Where's the old man? I don't know what you're talking about. Please. Oh, she's going nuts with this torch. No, <laughs> I don't. I don't. I need to know. 
He's not going to tell you anything now. Oh, dear God. He's really not going to tell you anything now. God, right, you can't you? Over. Get back to what the hell's going on in there? Mr. Molly, I lost your temper. Any sign of the old man? Nope. He's a tough bastard, but he won't get far. What about the other ones? We got him locked up in the caves. Why is Father Matthias keeping them alive? Might as well. <laughs> I've got to say, as crazy as it is, as crazy as Lara's bloodlust is, I do enjoy the shooting. It is quite satisfying, you've got to admit. Like, all the weapons do feel pretty good. Even this little pistol, which doesn't look that remarkable on the surface, you know, it does pack a punch. Oh, come on! I... what? Really? <laughs> Ow! It's not getting me any closer to my first aid. Seem to be going in the opposite direction here. I gotta just grab his crotch. That gets me that gets me all the salvage I need. <laughs> and I've mentioned Whoa, can I not climb up there? Oh jeez. Yeah, that nearly killed me. Wow. <laughs> I mentioned about collectibles before, but you know, they're quite satisfying in this game as well. I like a bit of light exploration. Not too much. <laughs> what the hell was that? I mean, I don't like exploration to the point where it feels like I'm just grinding for stuff. Grinding is like the worst thing ever. <laughs> well, that, that feeling that you get when you're doing it. That feeling of, I... I, you know, I could be, do I could learn a language in the time it's taking me to do this. You know what I mean? And you know, especially in a game that doesn't lend itself to that kind of thing. Like, you could never put too many in an action adventure game. Third person. You know, it just. It will become too much of a drag, no one's going to want to do that. I don't look like a need first day, I'm doing alright, apart from the fact I can't climb, you know, I could be taking these guys out as if it was nothing. <laughs> down them all, Laura, just down all those things, it's god diggity. These boots, I'll take them. Ah, lighter. Nature's natural painkiller, right? <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> non verbal shouts of pain. <laughs> well, I guess it's catering for the hard of hearing. You don't normally get that in games.
Now this is a neat little upgrade. The flaming arrows. I mean, as crazy as it sounds, Roth, can you hear me? it's sort of believable. <laughs> Roth? Lana, are you okay? I'm fine. You don't sound fine it's one of the few upgrades fine, in this game that's actually Where makes, are you still makes I'm sense. Some kind of shanty <laughs> town near the Fortify Palace. I'm still coming down the hill. How did you get there so fast? A long story. I can see the town from here. It's not that much of a long story, really. I just I'm heading towards it. Fell. Pretty much. Shit. Falling with style, that's the story. Oh come on, was the flare necessary? Oh my god, they Where's he find all these guys? Why is this in slow motion? Alright then. No, that's just immediately an evacuation. <laughs> My preferred method. For uh, obvious reasons, I feel. Oh! Jeez, unlucky buddy. I didn't I didn't want that. It makes you feel any better. Where is that even from? Oh my Christ. Oh all these barrels. Conveniently place me and my enemies. Yeah, you think they would know better. They live here, they should know better. They stand next to us. They probably put them there in the building. Good. Oh, we got another guy. Oh, this one, the bullet dodges. Hey, you know, Roth, if you want to get here a bit quicker, that would be great. Let's take a look at these flaming arrows, shall we? Like, it's the, I think it's the little... If you look very closely at her left hand there, when she she's kind of flicks the lighter on, and that's, that's a nice little touch that it doesn't just set on fire, you know? <laughs> I've always appreciated these little things. I got a skill point for didn't I? Aha. Upgrade the old assault rifle, somehow. Not gonna question it. All right, what can I get? Bone collector, meh. Recovering arrows, meh. Hidden rewards, meh. Give me something I can really use. Maximum more ammo. Dodging an enemy, stab him in the knee. Obviously. To cripple them and leave them vulnerable to a killing blow. I might get more ammo actually. Hell yeah. Alright, let's upgrade some stuff, shall we? Let's upgrade some stuff. So let's take a look at my rifle now. That is looking pretty nice. It's looking pretty swish. I like that. I don't know where I got all this stuff from. <laughs> is there something for damage there? Increased damage. I'll take that one. Hell yes. I do like how the weapons change, like the, the actual look of the weapons change as well. I can appreciate that. Padded grip. God, I can't even build any of this stuff. Alrighty, well I think I've done my bit. Alrighty, well I gotta pause it for now guys, but uh, thank you very much for watching this episode of Tomb Raider and please do join me for the next one guys. I will see you in a bit. See you later. Oh god, I fell.